hand carved concrete shapes, essential contractor software, authentic old wood look, and a contractor making good impressions in Michigan. That's all this week on Concrete Network TV. Hello everyone and welcome to Concrete Network TV. I'm Maureen Barley. Joe Wilgroup of Shide Concrete Incorporated submitted photos of a custom faux boulder spa and waterfall hand carved out of concrete. Using rebar, they built a cage to create the boulder formations. They wrapped the cage with galvanized mesh, then shot a base coat with shot creep. After the finished coat, they carved in the look of the boulders by hand. By using modified trowels, they were able to create the unique textures. The waterfall flowing down one side of the surround circulates underneath the tub and recycles through a filter system and pump, separate from the hot tub water. With over 12 years of experience, Shide Concrete Incorporated strives to offer the finest quality design, cost estimates, concrete construction, repair and alteration to clients needing small to large scale concrete construction services. To read more about this and other concrete project profiles, visit ConcreteNetwork.com and search Project Profiles. Old wood, old bricks, you name it and Stan Pace of Fossil Creek can create it. Truly authentic, realistic looks you want on any substrate surface. But really, Fossil Creek is all about creating virtually any look that you want on virtually any substrate. Our products are really special because we really go the extra mile to, to, to take them off of authentic pieces. Um, whatever it is, if it's a tree, we'll, we'll go find the best looking tree that we can find and, and that's what we make the product off of. We've got a, sted, a set of stamps from the Great Wall of China that we molded directly off the Great Wall of China. The uh, sea purlins that the steel building industry uses and it's just a great, very fast solution to, to big uh, decorative beams. You know, a lot of times the beams are not going to be structurally required but uh, th there's a desire for them aesthetically and we can just take these purlins, put them up there. Our material goes right on there with no, no reinforcing mesh or no bonding mesh, uh, just our Vertibond polymer followed up by our mix. So that'll go on there. And if we wanted to carry that right into a, a, a pool or a pond or a spa or what have you, we could go directly right down into the water with this material. Amazing. Thanks, Stan. For more information, be sure to check out FossilCreek.com. Want to close the deal faster and easier? Gary Gaplin from Depiction Software tells us he has two must-have computer programs designed specifically for the concrete contractor. Yes, we have computer imaging for decorative concrete. Basically what that is is so a contractor could go to somebody's home, take a picture, say, of a driveway where they want to show decorative concrete, and then show them different colors and patterns on that driveway so the homeowner can actually see what their driveway is going to look like with decorative concrete before they install it. That's our imaging software. Then we also have an estimating program that allows a contractor with a laptop to go in there, put in his products, his formulas for his material that he's going to be installing, and then actually <clears throat> It'll create an estimate for them, so it'll do pricing, and it would do uh, formulas how much of each product they're going to need to fulfill that job, and then it also prints out contracts right there on the spot. So they have a portable printer, they just click print, they've got a contract, an estimate in a matter of seconds. Thanks, Gary. For more information, visit depictionsoftware.com. This week's featured contractor serves up concrete from Grand Rapids, Michigan. Say hello to Concrete Impressions. Co-owners Mark Long and Jeff Grisco can create a custom floor specific to your needs. From thin stamped overlays that mimic the authentic look of stone, brick, and slate, to splatter texture finishes that create an elegant but useful non-slip finish on deteriorated concrete. Concrete Impressions work is split between residential and commercial. Their job numbers indicate 80% of the work is residential with the remaining 20% commercial. Weather doesn't seem to factor into the equation as 70% of their work is exterior and 30% interior. What's next for the guys at Concrete Impressions? It looks like concrete countertops and furniture, which will include tables, benches, flower pots, and planters. After taking Buddy Rhodes' workshop and being impressed with Buddy's system, Long says they'll definitely be using the press technique with molds. To read more about Concrete Impressions or other featured contractors, visit ConcreteNetwork.com and search Client Features. 
Well, that's all for now. Be sure to check back next week. We'll be hearing from Fu Tong Chang of Chang Products. Until then, for everyone here at Concrete Network TV, I'm Maureen Barley. Thanks for watching.